Hello folks! Welcome to the Poly Champions YouTube! Are you tired of wondering if your 6 hit point rider will kill a 5 hit point warrior? Tired of guessing how many units it will take to unsiege? Fed up with losing the game because you didn't attack in the right order? Then it's time for you to start using the Poly Calculator! This tutorial will show you how to use the bot in Discord. It's like what the battle preview does in the game, but has so much more potential. Let's get started. It's very common in the Polytopia Discord community for players to plan out their moves using the Poly Calculator bot. They take the time to find the optimal approach and how many units they need to win a battle. With the bot, you can calculate the outcome of any battle with one or multiple attacking units, return the optimal order to use multiple attackers, find out the number of attackers needed to kill a unit, display the optimal hit points needed to eliminate units, and a few other things. Every unit in the game has an attack value and a defense value. The bot uses a formula to do the math for you to see how much damage the attacking unit or units will do, if the defender unit survives, and if it does survive, how much retaliation damage is dealt in return. Go to a bot command's channel, then use the slash command to begin. Be careful though, other Discord bots use the slash commands too. Do slash C for calculate followed by the attacking unit's abbreviations, separated by commas, then the defender unit's abbreviation. The bot returns the outcome in the channel. This is for three riders attacking a defender. Let's do another one. How about a warrior and a rider and an archer and a polytar all attacking a giant? Yeah, it doesn't do much damage, but you get the idea, right? Most of the unit abbreviations in the bot are intuitive, but don't worry. If you forget the unit abbreviations, you can see a full list by typing slash units. That brings up a complete list of all the units by code. You can add unit hit point and defense bonus modifiers too. For hit points, include the number of hit points next to the unit abbreviation. So let's do an archer with five hit points and a warrior with eight hit points and a rider with seven hit points, all attacking a swordsman with 13 hit points. Yeah, not quite enough. To include a defense bonus, use the letter D next to the defender unit, like for a unit being hit while on a mountain. So let's do uh, two riders attacking a warrior on a mountain with a defense bonus. No, not enough to kill it. Uh, you can also use the letter W for uh, wall defense. Um, so a defender in a wall, walled city would be W, walled. There you go. The calculator works the same way for naval battles. So to calculate a giant battleship with 20 hit points, attacking a defender ship uh, with a defense bonus, looks like that. And you can also use alternative abbreviations for naval units. So GBS also works for giant battleships. Um, you can use DSH for defender ship. And then for boats, you can do WBO, warrior boat. Um, and that also works. You get the idea. The calculator can do more than just predict the outcome of a battle. The bot can show you the optimal order your units should attack. 
Let's compare the calc command with the optum command to see how it makes a difference in this real bullet game example. To stay alive, Blue needs to kill the teal giant sieging the capital. Blue has three warriors, two riders, and a giant with 22 hit points to kill a 35 hit point giant. Slash C, warrior, 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 rider, rider, giant with 22 hit points to kill a giant with 35 hit points. Warrior, 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 rider, rider, giant. Oh, not enough, not enough. Giant is still alive. But if you use the O command for Optim, you do warrior, warrior, rider, rider, giant with 22 hit points to kill a giant with 35 hit points. The bot tells you, you gotta hit first with the giant. That's the way to kill the other giant and stay alive. The bulk command calculates the number of attackers needed to kill a defender. So if you want to know how many riders it takes to kill a defender, you type slash B, then RI for the rider, DE for the defender. It takes four! So this tells you you would need four riders to kill a defender with no defense bonus. Three is not enough to finish it off. The elim command displays the optimal hit points a unit needs to eliminate another unit. You do this by putting a question mark next to one of the units with the elim command, either the attacker or the defender. So do slash e giant for 32 and then defender w with a question mark. This returns the hit points for the strongest walled defender a 32 hit point giant can kill. You can also do it the other way to see the minimum number of hit points a unit needs to kill a target. Do slash E, giant question mark, defender wall 10. This returns the weakest giant needed to kill a walled defender with 10 hit points. And sometimes the bot tells you that it cannot be done, so don't bother trying. Thanks for watching. Be sure to like and subscribe, it helps us a lot. For Poly Champions games with skilled players and expert commentary, click the links in the description. Join the Poly Champions Discord server, ask questions there, get on a team! The Discord link is also in the description. Take care, see you in the next one.